Hello guys, I'm going to reveal my face in 3, 2, 1, the people who haven't seen my YouTube channel. They want to see my face, because why not? Yeah, I'm Asian, and I sound a lot different than I look. Don't mind that. Today I'm going to be talking about more dream drama. Again, I need, I need views. Shut up. So, yesterday a lot of people actually liked my video, which I'm proud of. Thank you guys for actually liking my content. If you guys want to uh, click the subscribe button while you're down there uh, liking the video. But, uh... Besides that, like begging and the subscribing, um, we're gonna be talking about more dream merch. And yesterday, I definitely went into t into uh, detail about how, like, it was overpriced, it was bland looking, and it was bad. But I'm gonna go more in depth. This is a forty dollar hoodie, forty dollars, and it's also a blend of cotton and polyester, just like dream, just like dream merch. You might be wondering what this says. It says it says Schlatten coat. I can't speak. I'm having a stroke. But uh, this looks a lot better than a smiley face. I'm pretty sure a lot of people will think that this looks a lot better than just a smiley face on a t-shirt. And I get that that's Dream's logo. It still looks so bland. Make something a lot better. You can you can get so much stuff. You can make a really good looking smiley face design if you wanted to. You could branch out into different ideas. The sky's the limit. There's a reason why people love Elvis the Aliens merch so much with a guy with 1 million subscribers compared to 14 million. The fact that people can't, like, people like Elvis the Aliens merch because he doesn't put a slap a logo on it and that's it. He even addresses this. He wants to put original designs on his t-shirts with his team. That's what he does. And people love the merch. And people like Dream's merch as well. I know that. But the problem is, is that Dream has 14 million subscribers, a lot more money than Elvis has. I'm not saying that Elvis the Alien doesn't have a whole lot of money, because he probably does. He has 1 million subscribers, so he's going to have a lot of money. The problem is, is that Dream has 14 million of that, and he puts ads on every single one of his videos, and yet he can't make good designs for his t-shirts. Why? He definitely has a team. He definitely has a team. 14 million subscribers. You're not going to be, like, single-handedly making the merch by yourself, unless you're, like very hardworking and very dedicated but I don't think Dream is very dedicated I'm sorry or his team I'm sorry but I don't think they're very dedicated to this work I'm not the one to judge here but again put more like umph in your design put like better like, better looking smiles put better like branch out into original content or not original content original uh, t-shirt designs don't revolt don't just result to smiley face that's it because that's basically dreams and march in a nutshell i already told you about a 50 dollar water bottle fifth not 15 50 dollar water bottle that just had a smile on his face and it was, it was a tin water bottle it just has a smile on his face they smell they sell it for like 15 or 50 dollars why why would you buy that just buy a normal looking tin water bottle you could buy that for like 25 dollars or 15 why would you buy something with a little smile on its face? That's the only thing that changed. You could legit get a marker and draw a smiley face on it. It would be the exact same thing. It might not look as clean as Dreams merch, but I'm pretty sure you can you can be fine with that. It doesn't have to look shiny and beautiful. I mean, obviously, people want that out of their merch, but it also needs a good design, which is what Dream does not have, sadly. I do like Dream. I find his content entertaining before the stands go comment. You don't like his 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 content. You're, you're I'm a keyboard warrior. I go type, I go type, I, I go defend Dream at every single instance. I like Dream. I think he's entertaining. The problem is is that I don't like his speed runs, I don't like his response to stands, I don't like his merch. I like his content. That's the only thing I like. I don't like his just over over like weird like stuff on Twitter I hate that stuff um, I also don't like that he responded to Josh saying you're an idiot that's it that, that, that's legit all he said when Josh put up a good point I don't like that he did that because that was really immature of him uh, his merch is also overpriced and he also faked the speed run but I still like his content that doesn't mean I don't like his content he made one piece of content that nobody liked but I like his manhunt videos. They're entertaining. Even if they are scripted, I still like them. I don't care. The problem is, is when you're selling like overpriced merch that looks so bland, it's almost as bland as a plain t-shirt. It is just boring. It, the definition of boring, just 
like put some creativity into it and don't just put like a smile and a little Santa hat and a little crown. And keep in mind that every time he hits a 1 million subscriber milestone, which I will admit is a pretty good, but not really for him because he's 14 million, but every time he gets it. Do you notice that he puts 14 million coins and 14 million hoodies on his website, on his merch website? Yeah, you don't need to do that for every time you get a million more subscribers, but he does. You wanna know why? He wants money. He, he wants money. He wants money. He wants money. That, that's the reason why he does it. But they don't even look good. The coins don't look good at all. As I said before, YouTube's plushies look ten times better. Ten times better. I'm going to go stop the recording now. Ah.